Hello, I'm Dr. Manish Asar, Medical Director of Cardiac Electrophysiology and a practicing cardiac electrophysiologist at Baylor Scott & White Heart and Vascular Hospital in Dallas. With this brief video, I am pleased to introduce you to the Heart Rhythm Center, provide information about atrial fibrillation, the most common heart rhythm disorder, and discuss other types of heart rhythm problems we diagnose and treat. Maybe you're a patient that's been told you have an irregular heartbeat or a heart arrhythmia, or perhaps you are a physician, advanced nurse practitioner provider, or clinician that cares for patients with heart rhythm issues. I hope you find this video informative, and after viewing it, you will agree the Heart Rhythm Center is a destination of choice for heart rhythm care. The Heart Rhythm Center is dedicated to healing patients with arrhythmias by effectively managing their condition through diagnosis, education, treatment options, and post-discharge care. We understand that each patient's care is unique, so we tailor treatment to each patient's specific needs. Specialized medications, implanted devices, catheter-based procedures, and surgical options are available and may be used in combination at Baylor Scott & White Heart and Vascular Dallas. A key to our success is the collaborative, multidisciplinary focus we use to address heart rhythms. Our expert healthcare team consists of specially trained cardiologists who specialize in heart rhythm abnormalities who are called electrophysiologists. We also have cardiac surgeons, advanced practice providers, and cardiac nurses along with imaging specialists who are passionate about treating patients with rhythm disturbances. Atrial fibrillation, commonly known as AFib, is the most common heart rhythm problem we see. This irregular heartbeat or arrhythmia is described by many patients as a quivering sensation. Other symptoms may include racing heartbeat, slow heartbeat, chest pain, ongoing fatigue and tiredness, shortness of breath, lightheadedness or dizziness. Left untreated, it can lead to blood clots, stroke, heart failure and other cardiovascular complications. The American Heart Association estimates nearly 3 million Americans are living with atrial fibrillation. While AFib may not be triggered by any specific cause, many AFib sufferers recognize symptoms and behaviors that lead to their episodes. In AFib, the upper chambers of the heart beat irregularly instead of beating effectively to move blood into the ventricles. If a blood clot develops and breaks off, it can enter the bloodstream and lodge into an artery leading to the brain, resulting in a stroke. About 15 to 20 percent of people who have strokes have AFib. The risk of developing blood clots is why people with AFib are put on blood thinning medications. AFib doubles the risk of heart-related deaths and is associated with an increased risk of stroke by five times. In addition to AFib, we also diagnose and treat these arrhythmias. Atrial flutter, atrial or ventricular tachycardia, premature contractions either in the atrial or ventricle, ventricular fibrillation, and multiple other arrhythmias. We know that some lifestyle changes have been shown to effectively treat atrial fibrillation. Consuming a healthy diet, increasing physical activity, avoiding and managing stress are usually the first recommended treatments unless the patient's condition warrants more aggressive therapy. We offer a full range of specialized minimally invasive surgical treatment interventions. One of the most common minimally invasive techniques we use is catheter ablation therapy using a transcatheter approach. Cardiac ablation uses heat or cold energy in the heart to block irregular electrical signals and restore a typical heartbeat. The procedure is used to correct heart rhythm problems, known as arrhythmias. Baylor Scott & White Heart and Vascular Hospital Dallas has pioneered the convergent hybrid procedure. Alrighty, here we are. Electrophysiologists team up with a cardiothoracic surgeon who ablates signals from the outside surface of the heart. Another procedure performed by surgeons on the medical staff is called the maze procedure, another minimally invasive procedure using ablation applied in a maze pattern. To accurately pinpoint areas in the heart that are causing irregular heartbeats, electrophysiologists use 3D mapping of the heart to identify areas generating faulty electrical signals that are targeted for complex arrhythmia ablation. The electrophysiologists on the medical staff are experienced in performing cardiac resynchronization therapy using an implantable pacemaker. Heart Rhythm Center physicians are often called on to repair or maintain pacemakers, including lead removal, blocked blood vessels, or infection. You might be surprised to learn that sleep apnea can cause cardiac arrhythmias. To address this problem, the Heart Rhythm Center physicians employ the Respercardia Remed system, a battery-powered device implanted by an electrophysiologist under the patient's skin in the upper chest to treat central sleep apnea by using phrenic nerve stimulation. 
Another important minimally invasive procedure performed by Heart Rhythm Center physicians is left atrial appendage closure, a treatment strategy to reduce the risk of left atrial appendage blood clots from entering the bloodstream and causing a stroke in patients with non-valvular atrial fibrillation. The Tesla Magnetic Resonance Imaging offers heart rhythm patients a distinct advantage. The hospital's cardiac imaging capabilities include advanced MRI safe imaging options for patients with cardiac implantable devices, including non-conditional pacemakers and defibrillators who previously could not undergo an MRI. Why is the Heart Rhythm Center the choice for referring physicians and their patients? The Heart Rhythm Center guides heart patients and their families to the correct healthcare provider for ongoing care of their arrhythmia. We also provide second opinions for cardiac rhythm disturbances. Our care extends beyond the walls of the hospital by assigning a staff member to each patient after he or she is discharged. Thank you for placing your trust in us to care for your heart rhythm problem. We look forward to serving you and helping to improve your overall heart health.